Science for Young Minds is an open access scientific journal where real life scientists represent their work to younger audience and the manuscripts they submit is being reviewed by younger viewers aged between 8 to 15. Frontiers for Young Minds is an open source that's open for all of the uh, kids all over the internet and it's being a reliable source for all these children to learn about science and uh, as we are the next generation I feel we are the reason we, why we can thrive into a healthier planet and a healthier society. Frontiers platform is such an incredible platform that gives all students and all people and all kids the ability to learn science because the, the Frontiers makes science more fun and more enjoyable and more understandable in a way where it's really, it makes it a really important thing to learn. It's by kids, for kids, making otherwise complex topics quite easy to comprehend. And while reviewing, they became aware of scientific process, pre-reviews, and the steps of publishing, which make them more appreciative of seeking the right knowledge. Being a member of Frontiers for Young Minds has made me think about, like, I really want to send a message to the, the minds of future that are going to handle our future, since our life are go is going to depend on that, since they are going to work with the medical care and the politics and all. So I wanted to send a message to show them what, uh, what the problems are. I was very impressed about the ability of these very young people to critically think about what they were reading, express their views, their visions, and be critical about science. Kids are the future generation, and I strongly believe that the way we develop the world should be based on science. It was very interesting to write this paper because we had to explain all the concepts very, very clearly, much more than when we write technical papers. And uh, it's been incredible. I was able to engage my own kids in uh, the project and I hope that we uh, can make the new generations aware of what we are doing to our planet and how we can try to make it more livable and more sustainable. I'm really excited about this live review. I'm really uh, interested in meeting those kids who uh, help us review that paper. And I'm really looking forward to hear about their comments on our paper that we wrote together. Your event today is of great importance, ladies and gentlemen. So I wholeheartedly welcome it as a public platform for universities, research, and all of those involved in science. Science is a key factor for the future viability of society in all its facets. So for me, to help scientists, which is an unbelievable statement, uh, to actually share their knowledge with others is such an incredible thing to do. Our children that will need to uh, rely on science for their informed decisions in whatever roles they come to play in the future to solve the challenges of their times. Education and research are basic requirements for ensuring individual well-being, for uh, ensuring economic growth so that everything we do in and out makes sense and has a purpose. And uh, we are going to present our um, manuscript because it's not yet a paper, not being yet accepted. Hi everybody, thank you so much for being here. We're really happy to be here with you and especially with you, our young reviewers. And yes, we're going to talk to you about um, this very hot topic, so marine heat waves. Reviewing this paper, it's opened my eyes more because now I can see how we are affecting the other organisms too. Because 
Like previously we were thinking about only ourselves, like as humans, but also now I'm thinking about the other organisms. So definitely I've changed like my mindset and also some of my actions toward the environment. So now I would like to ask my reviewer, would they accept the paper or reject the paper? Uh, we happily accept this paper to be published. Thank you. Thank you so much. I just love science. It's something that brings you joy every day, something that gives the world the power to change. And it really um, showcases that in a really good way. So, yeah. Wow.